Appalachian Wireless has some of the best data rates in wireless on our plans, and not to mention an amazing deal on one of our hottest smartphones. But that's all the time I have to explain. See store for details. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. About 24 hours ahead of a planned rally by white nationalists, Pikeville Friday afternoon seemed to be a city quietly on edge. Several businesses in town have chosen not to open on Saturday when the rally by the Traditionalist Workers Party is planned. The group is identified as a neo-Nazi hate group by the Southern Poverty Law Center, and where the controversial group goes, opposing groups have been known to follow. One such group was in Pikeville Friday afternoon handing out flyers produced by Solidarity Defense denouncing the TWP's white nationalist message. These, these cats, you know, they want to talk like they're trying to build a friendly white future, but they're not playing around and they're violent and we're, uh, we want to oppose them and also want to be smart about it. The group, who asked not to be interviewed on camera, said they are not affiliated with any large anti-fascist group, but they support the efforts of those groups. They also said if the opposition against the Traditionalist Workers' Party or any other racially motivated groups comes to violence, then so be it. Yeah, I mean, I think that they need to be opposed in any way possible. And uh, so yeah, that all depends on what the situation looks like and also what they do. You know, they tend to instigate in this kind of situation. And so when, when, if there are confrontations, if there are physical confrontations, you know, we expect to see that start from them. The spokesperson for the group said their message of anti-Nazism and anti-fascism was well received by people in a nervous Pikeville. In downtown Pikeville, Chris Anderson, EKB News.